Good morning, it is Friday the 27th, it's about 5 a.m. We're about to go on a run here. Uh, we're gonna go do a six mile uh, workout here. Nothing too crazy. We're gonna do three miles at 8.50 pace and then we're gonna bump it up, coming back three miles at around 8.45, maybe 8.40ish pace. Um, this is just so that we kind of introduce a little bit, a little bit more speed um, with a little bit more miles. So uh, it's a little warmer out there, about 70 something. So it's a little muggy, so it's gonna test our heart, but overall, I think we're gonna do pretty good. So I'll take y'all along with me. Let's go. Mile one, 8.45. A little faster than I'd like, but still feeling pretty good. Mile two, 901. A little better. 8.52 for our third mile. We're gonna go ahead and turn it around and try to kick it up a little bit. See if we can't get it in the 840s, but overall we're doing good. It's a little more humid than I thought it would be today, but uh, picking it up, pushing it a little bit, we'll be okay. Mile four, 835. Mile five, 832. Almost there. Mile six, 828. That was a pretty good workout for the most part. Uh, I think the second half, when, uh, the final three miles, got my heart rate pretty much in the 170s. So, okay, so overall we did 6.1 miles at 52 minutes, 19 seconds. Average pace was 8.42, average heart rate was 155, and our max heart rate was 173. So that's kind of what I expected. Today is actually a pretty humid day, but overall it was a good run. Uh, try to take care of myself as best I can. I'll see if I can get a, an afternoon workout, which will be the first one of the week, which is unacceptable, but as life does happen sometimes, you just try to fit it in where you can. And then tomorrow, Saturday, we'll have uh, four miles, maybe five. And then Sunday, we'll have 15 miles. So I'll definitely take you guys along with that. So you guys be good. And I'll see you around. What is going on, guys? It is Sunday, October 29th. Not too far from Halloween. But I'll tell you right now, it definitely does not feel like Halloween out there. It's about 37 degrees outside. Uh, it feels like 29, 15 mile an hour winds. Um, Speaking of 15, we have 15 miles today. Uh, I was going to go up to the city and run with some friends, but they decided to cancel because of how cold and windy it was. But um, some days you're going to have help and some days you're not. So the thing is you just got to kind of keep pushing forward. So we're going to get ready, get fueled up. We're going to get ourselves warmed up as much as possible. And then we're going to go out there and we're going to go ahead and get these 15 miles done. How I kind of plan to do this is I want to be able to, uh, I want to be able to run about 10 miles and I'm going to have me a, a drink that I'll be running with electrolytes, uh, Gatorade, some liquid IV and whatnot. I'll have some honey stinger gels and then I'll have like a honey stinger waffle probably about five minutes before I run. And then I'm gonna also try to see if I can tackle some oatmeal real quick, uh, say some a banana and some, um, some honey. It's cold, it's definitely gonna, the temperature is supposed to drop all throughout the day and um, I, there's chances of rain that'll be coming in and out while I'm running. So. We just got to be able to kind of brave the cold, but I'm going to take you guys with me the whole way. So uh, with that being said, and further ado, let's get after it. So as you can see, this is kind of what we get. A little bit of rain, a little bit of drizzliness. For the most part, we're out here. We're going to go ahead and start getting our run in. Uh, it's only going to stay windy. It's only going to stay colder. It's going to stay like this pretty much all run. So let's get it after it. So let's get after it. Yeah, yeah, let's get after it. Let's go. I don't want to, but let's do this. Mile one, 9.35. Mile two, 9.33. Ended up doing a little clothes shaving. So it's gonna be cold and windy, but 15 miles in, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be loving this weather by then. Mile three, 9.26. Mile four, 10.03. Had to walk and pull my damn goose out, but we're good to go. Mile five, 931. Mile six, 941. Time for sale number two. Mile eight, 926. Cruising along. Yikes. I'm on OU campus, so looks like there weren't too many happy campers that OU lost to Kansas. Mile nine, 9.25, third goo, about a mile and a half before we start turning north, we really start catching some wind. But hey, 
They say it's too cold, it's too rainy, it's too windy. Fuck, dude. I say after the summer that we had, with all that 117, 120, 30 uh, temperatures, ooh, no way, dude. I'm taking this one in. Goggins ain't the only one ready to pull some fucking boats. Let's go. Mile 10, 9 to 14. These next five miles is gonna be our working set. We're gonna try to hit them at sub nine minute mile and see what we can do. Finish strong, we're doing good. Our heart rate's been under 140 almost the whole time, so that's really good. Uh, gotta compliment the cold weather, keeping the heart rate low, body cool, but from here on out, we may jump up above 150, but that's okay. Try to finish this up. There's our little marathon pacing, I guess. Here we go. Mile 11, 846. Mile 12, 847. Almost there. Almost at mile 13, boo-boo break. It's bound to happen eventually. See you, chump. <laughs> what the hell? Mile 13, 921. Officially hit half marathon for October. Good deal. Mile 14, 838. And there we have it, mile 15. Honestly, I can't remember. Uh, I think it was like an 815 or something like that. Um, my watch is sitting at like 2%. Uh, beeped at me before like with like maybe 10 meters to go. So I was trying to haul ass just a little bit, but um, overall 918 average pace 15.1 uh, miles average HR 139 Time two hours 19 minutes and 47 seconds uh, Great run. Honestly, my legs feel really good. My body feels good If anything, I would say like my pelvic or my groins or something like that is the only thing that hurts and uh, that probably comes with playing soccer on the weekends, but uh, good run overall. I'm super happy about it. Uh, you guys can uh, follow me on Strava, Charles Mantigi, or you guys can check out my TikToks. Uh, I usually do more funny stuff on there, so um, it's whatever. But like, subscribe, do whatever you guys do. Enjoy your weekend. Next week we have 20 miles, so going from 15 to another five. If someone said, could I do another five miles, I could say yes. I would need a second to kind of stretch out again, but I would be ready for it. Uh, gloomy day, but overall we took it in, enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoy your weekend. Be good. I'll see you around. Run it.